We have an ID system in Kenya which is um, semi-automated, part of it, there is a bit of automation but quite minimal. Going forward, we are looking at uh, upgrading our current automated fingerprint identif identification system, AFIS, into an automated biometric identification system, which goes beyond the fingerprints and involves the iris and the, uh, and the, and, and, and the iris, the fingerprints, as, also, uh, as well as facial recognition. The other thing, Your Excellency, is that going forward, we are moving towards uh, an electronic ID with a machine-readable chip and QR code, and uh, eventually this should lead us to a digital ID system, which will allow web-based ID authentication. And in the long run, transit all that into a universal a personal identifier, a unique, sorry, a unique personal identifier, uh, which we are going to give all new bonds in Kenya, and uh, it becomes the, their ID when they attain the age of majority at 18. So, Your Excellency, I think we are on the right uh, forum. This is a forum which will make us uh, move into the digital world and move Kenya's uh, registration of persons, Kenya's identity system to the next level. And we are very happy with the kind of cutting edge technology that have been demonstrated during the exhibition. I welcome everyone and I look forward to learning and picking ideas which we can integrate uh, as, 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 as the people of Kenya as we move towards um, modernizing our ID uh, system. Together, Your Excellency, with your government, we have made history this week. And this is only just the beginning. It's clear that the exceptional cooperation that we received from your government is a reflection of your support of the digital identity agenda and our identity for all movement. So please accept my heartfelt and sincere gratitude. Your Excellency, I'd like to bring to your attention in closing a matter that has become the rallying cry for the identity for all movement across Africa and the world. 
and that is Identity Day. I'd like to appeal to you to officially recognize 16 September as a national day of identity. Identity is the most valuable asset people have, yet there is no day commemorating or celebrating it. The choice of the date is very symbolic, since it pays homage to the UN Sustainable Development Goal 16.9 which calls for legal identity for all, including birth registration, by 2030. The commemorative day can be used to sensitize the population about the importance of having their identity, and it signals your government's commitment to empowering people through identity and to protecting their data and privacy. President Ruto, Your Excellency, Afri Africa is looking for Kenya's leadership in this important domain. I appeal to you to add 16 September as Identity Day on your identity agenda.